We're down here at Westmead Children's Hospital. It's obviously Pamper the Parents Day. Um, Cassidy's a hardboard. I think they've been on for six years putting this on. We get about 200 volunteers from everywhere, all across New South Wales. Everyone's donated their time. We all join forces to give a day of joy to the parents and a day of reprieve and fun to the children that are sick. As a parent myself, uh, with two healthy kids, you understand how important it is to support these guys when, they're, when their children are doing it tough, you know. Um, and being an, uh, a now retired footballer, you know, we used to love uh, coming down to the children's hospital and trying to make the kids smile. And to be here to support the parents uh, is, is really important. You know, they don't get much time for themselves, so it's great to come down. It's, it's always a fun event, so it's good to be involved. It's you, come on down. Today means that other people care about them too and just for one moment they get to think about something else. Just for one moment they get to see a smile on their child's face. We've got hairdressers, beauticians, nail artists, face painters, clowns, magicians. We've got entertainment, we've got footballers. We've got a day of fun and reprieve for the parents. It's great. Hello, darling. How are you? Hello. <laughs> We get the clowns to deliver 408 pamper packs to Westmead Children's Hospital and 48 to the Ronald McDonald House Westmead and entertain the kids that can't come down for the day as well. Thanks for coming. You're welcome. It's really nice. It's such an amazing opportunity. These, these parents and kids obviously go through a lot in their lives and the, the kids just get so much enjoyment out of it. You know, the touch, the feel, the sensation of this is fantastic. It's been amazing. So we're currently raising money for a heart-lung machine. This is an absolutely critical component of the equipment we need and very expensive. So they do approximately 550 operations here per year. And of those, 70% 70, 70 of them will need a heart-lung bypass machine for the operation. Without them, the program would not be possible. And my favourite part is watching people all join forces together, a community spirit. It gives you faith in humankind. Yeah.